So there's this crop circle that is a response to Carl Sagan's original 1974 binary code uh, that they sent out into space, which illustrates uh, of what life is like on Earth. Really, it's just a couple illustrations that of about mathematics that we have a double helix DNA um, that we are you know around six feet tall that we're carbon-based life forms. Uh, but anyway, the crop circle, if you just watch the vid to, in the description, it says that uh, they are not carbon-based life form, but silicone-based. And it says that they occupy the fourth, fifth, and sixth planets in their solar system, and we only occupy the third. And it also says that they have around 27 billion people, and our message said only 6 billion. So if there's 6 billion on each inhabitable planet, inhabitable planet over there then that would make sense you know six billion for each planet um, and a lot of other shit it just said that they had a triple helix DNA spiral um, triple helix man I mean but it did still have like kind of a big alien head and it's kind of unrealistic but I mean if that's what they're like then that's what they're like we're gonna have to accept that the cheesy movie version might be the real version it doesn't make it any less real because it's cheesy looking. I kind of had um, a realization. So if you're having a Mars conjunct moon transit and your moon is in the same place as like, your girlfriend's Mars, you can read that transit as your relationship. So f for instance, like if I'm Aquarius and I'm, I'm dating a Leo, which is the exact opposite of me, then I'll read a sun opposition, sun transit, and it's just kind of a little more, it kind of gives you a kind of personalized reading, um, but you need the books first, I guess.